want to go in. Welcome to this Mac Helper's video tutorial on using FaceTime for the iPad. Go ahead and launch your FaceTime app. This is a very quick and straightforward app to use. You're going to notice as soon as you launch it, you're using the front camera. So you can see my hand coming over the top of it. Uh, and you're going to see you've got your contacts over to the right. From here, you're going to be able to go and find a contact. So say I wanted to FaceTime with my grandfather. Uh, it's going to pull up his contact information. I can send him a message, or I can just go ahead and FaceTime him from here. Uh, you're going to see you've got all your contacts in here that you're going to just, basically just like calling someone, if they've got the ability to FaceTime, you're going to be able to FaceTime like you would calling them. Uh, you're going to see the recent ones that you've had when you FaceTimed people. So I FaceTimed with my brother. Um, you can see the missed ones. I don't have any missed, all of them. You can edit and you can delete, you know, ones that you FaceTime. You've also got your favorites. If you wanted to set and have your whole family in here for favorites, or if you're getting this gift for somebody else and you want to help set them up with people they might FaceTime with, you can add their favorites in there so it's really easy for you to just tap the person's name and try and FaceTime with them. Not available right now, he's not on a Wi-Fi, so that would be how I would FaceTime him. So that is really it for using the FaceTime app. There is not a whole lot else to it. Um, one of the great features of using the Apple products is that you can FaceTime anyone with an Apple device, uh, computer, iPad, iPhone, iPod Touch. Uh, makes it really great for staying in touch and helping people uh, not miss out on some of the exciting moments in life because they are uh, you're separated by some you know a certain amount of miles. So uh, start using FaceTime and uh, enjoy.